Hi, I'm Johan Peters. I'm with Geotate. Geotate is a new company and we are active in GPS technology designed for digital cameras. So what I would like to show you today is uh, an exciting new way of doing GPS in digital cameras. This is the first high volume GPS enabled digital camera. And what we do is really different compared to the traditional GPS uh, which is used today in, uh, in uh, navigation devices. The big problem with GPS today is that GPS has a very long startup time. Our technology allows you to do really point and shoot type of GPS and just push the shutter and have enough information to do a GPS calculation. What's the trick in our, uh, in our solution is that we, we don't calculate the GPS in the device but we post process, post process it and we calculate it in a PC. The result of this uh, approach is that it is really point and shoot, there is no startup time and there is hardly any battery drain. I would like to show you what we did yesterday. We went on the strip in Las Vegas and we took this camera, we just uh, uh, took uh, several pictures and we, I'm going to show you how this looks like on, uh, on a PC after post-processing. So what I'm going to do, I'm uploading the pictures from the camera. So I'm uploading them in the application and what you will see is that at the same time we're going to start calculating the GPS coordinates of these pictures. This is happening on this PC and it's not happening in the camera. So this will take a, a few seconds. He is calculating the position of the first picture and you will see the positions popping up on this map. I'm going to zoom in. And you will see that every single picture will be displayed on, uh, on this map. We're using Microsoft Virtual Earth. Of course, we can also use Google Earth. We can upload to Flickr or any online photo application. What, what does it bring for the user? For instance, I can click on any picture. So here, this is a fountain in front of the Caesars Palace in Las Vegas. The interesting thing is also that at the same time, we're pulling information about this location and showing it here in these applications. For instance, this is the Las Vegas Boulevard uh, and Bracken uh, Road in Nevada. And that's also automatically geotagged in the exit format of this uh, picture. So if I, if I click on the picture, so this picture is shown here. I can, I can take another one. Clicking on this picture shows me the location on the map. I can zoom in. So this data comes for free from the internet, so you don't have to pay for it, that's just all available on the internet. I can have different views, for instance, I can have a bird's eye view of the same location. This is the location looking here at the fountain at the Mirage Hotel, and this is the picture I took. Now if I want to have more information about this picture, I can just click on the picture, detailed information, and it's pulling up information from the internet. So we are in front of the Mirage Hotel. And in addition, I get more information about all the other hotels in the neighborhood and they are, they are shown here on another map. This is all available for free on the internet. In addition, I can start pulling up more information about this location, clicking here on the Mirage. Okay, let me do that again. From the internet, I get another picture from the Mirage and I get an explanation about the hotel. Mirage is a 3044 room hotel and I can also go to Wikipedia. This shows you what can be done if pictures are geotagged with, uh, with GPS using this new uh, GPS technology. Okay, we have just uh, explained uh, what we are doing with GPS embedded in sh point and shoot cameras. Uh, of course, we also have the existing cameras, uh, existing cameras with hot shoes and we have developed or in the process of developing this uh, hot shoe GPS unit. It is the same principle, there is no startup time, and there is hardly any battery drain. This device has a hot shoe uh, connector, it has a GPS receiver, there is no, there is no switch to, to switch it on or off, it's completely automatic. So what I do, I just take any standard hot shoe enabled camera, I plug on the device on that camera, and the moment I'm pushing the shutter, to take a picture, the GPS is enabled, it's waking up and it's taking the, the, the GPS data which we store in the memory in this device. When I'm coming home, I'm uploading my pictures like I showed you before. The difference here is that I need to pull off the 
raw GPS data, unprocessed GPS data, which we will process in the PC. I hook up the uh, standard USB. All right, let me see here. Hooking up the USB and the data is transferred to my PC and I have exactly the same process and exactly the same advantages as what I have shown you before on this uh, on the on the Geotate application. Uh, so this device uh, we expect to come in the market by the second half of this year for a suggested retail price somewhere in the range of $39. Uh, if you want to have more information about Geotate, please visit our website at www.geotate.com. Thank you very much. Bye.